All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game One Life. My name is Typo, and this is Power World Part 18. And today, we are almost assuredly gonna have our level get caught up to by the amount of days we have played. Because these are days 35 and 36, and I do not see us reaching level 37 today. Wow, a ferocious plant bell, let's go. Yeah, I just don't see us hitting level 37 today. 146,000 experience is kind of a lot. But, you know, I guess it's possible. They keep lumbering anyway, don't they? Just waiting on that ore to spawn so they can get to work on the other stuff. We got ingots cooking. Things are going well there. We got fried eggs cooking, for sure. 75 fried eggs, huh? Let's uh, split that in half. Take half for us and put half in the really big feed box for the egg theater deer, which is going to be hungry, obviously. <coughs> there you go. Now you got some food, egg theater deer. Go eat that. Let's go disassemble these. We have two more bed. We have one extra bed compared to uh, what we need. We need to figure out where we're going to put down the power generator. We have so much work to do today. I'm super amped. God, it's going to be so good. <laughs> we're, we're doing it. We're really doing it. So today is going to be like almost completely dedicated to... Thank you guys for working on that. I really appreciate that. Almost completely dedicated to the base. We are just going to be working on the base today. We've got a lot of work ahead of us in the base. Um, screw it. Let's make the grand piano. I really want it to be here. I know it's only five ingots. We'll be okay. Yes. You put the grand piano here like this, maybe? Oh, that would look good to me. That looks good to me. You might, you guys might think that's a bit cramped, but I think that looks good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That'll look nice. All right. Uh, we'll keep working in here later. We got a lot of stuff to work on out here. We got the makeshift handgun. Nice. Now we just need a lot more ingots and one more high-quality power oil. We're going to leave the base one time real quick because we know that the relaxosauruses in this area drop high-quality power oil. And so we'll. It, I think they travel in pairs, so we'll take on two of them, but... I think we're going to take on two Relaxosauruses, get some pal oil together. Oh, dang it, guys. Are you serious? And then we'll have the high-quality pal oil we need for the handgun. <clears throat> nice. This one's all alone. That's perfect. All right. Let's dismount. Whoops. Oh, armor's broken. Excellent. We love that. No! Stop, guys! Hold up. Let's kill the let's kill the syndicate thugs. Good. Okay. Good. Good. Okay, come back. Now let's catch this Relaxosaurus. Oh wait, did it heal? Why does it have so much health? I thought it was lower than that. There we go. Eight percent. Throw a mega sphere probably. Oh yeah, the odds are looking good on a Megasphere. Not guaranteed though. There it is. Alright, we have enough. Burly body, sure. I think they're all gluttons, to be fair. Back to base. We did get some high quality power. Yeah, just the one, but that's fine. That's all we needed. Alright, this is the last weapon we need to make for sure. Um, I know we still need to make the single shot rifle as well, but... I don't even know if it can be made on this workbench, to be honest. Thank you for those ingots. Power generator first. That's first priority. Um, I think we need 50 for it, though. I don't think we can make it right now. Damn, we're going to have to wait. We need cement. We have never made cement before. Paldium fragments. True. I need to go into a cave and just mine that stuff. Well, I can't believe it. I thought I was going to be in the base all day, and already that plan has gone to ruins. Um, let me drop the gun stuff off for a second. Repair this armor, because it does need repairing. Which is going to take even... Oh, this armor. Gotcha. Man. All these ingots just disappearing on me. Definitely need to repair that, or we're not going to be able to get what we need out of there. Okay. We'll take the catcher's fur and the power fluids back. There's the guns for now. 
We will return. Oh, wait, hold up. We can put the power fluids back because we can move this in. There we go. I'm going to put this here. Okay. Alright, let's go mine some pal oil, because the Rain Syndicate Tower has a cave right next to it, full of palladium. Man, I really thought we were not going to be leaving the base this often today, but it's four ingredients. It's first stuff we need. And boy, do we need them. Might, I, might mine some ore while we're here, too. Um, yes, please. Simply because the amount of ore, the amount of ingots we have cooking right now is just not enough. So we'll just ore, we'll just mine this whole like entryway here. We need palladium fragments for a bunch of stuff that we're running low on. Look at our sphere count: ten gigaspheres, five pal spheres, three megaspheres. That ain't it, chief. <laughs> we need a lot more than that, and we need a lot more megaspheres nowadays because pal spheres are no longer cutting it. Hmm. We did change a party member, right? Yeah, we have Bronze Cherry Aqua in here now. Okay. The work ahead of us is big, but I'm super excited for all of it. Super excited for all of it. All that good stuff. I don't know how many Paladin Pregnants we need, but it's a lot. Probably just gonna just load up on Paladium Fragments in here if we get the opportunity. Wow, this ore kept lasting, didn't it? There it is. Alright, we'll mine more Paladium Fragments until we are out of inventory, I guess. And that should work just fine. I would think. We don't need Kilimaris and Fuddlers, we're good on that. We don't need more ore because we can't carry more ore at the moment, we just need Palbium. Palbium there, Palbium here, good. Just load up on it because it's been a while. <laughs> All that time in the base I wanted to build stuff and we just don't have the stuff. We have tons of stone and tons of wood. However, the other supplies, a little lacking. A little lacking. Thanks for coming, I guess. I suppose. Alright, this will probably be good enough. For now. Okay. Um, is that the boss? That's the boss. Alright. I was gonna leave out the entrance, but I mean, if it's right here... Let's just... Let's just exit the proper way. Another Mao Alpha. We have one of these already, but I'll catch another one, sure. Huggy fire time. Burn him to a crisp. They are not ready for Pyra's power. Come on in, Pyra. 19% with the normal pal spheres. Come on, get in there. Really? Whoops, good bounce. 15% because it's not on fire anymore. Only one more pal sphere if this breaks. Okay. Vanguard Runner Botanical Barrier. That's a pretty good Mao, to be honest. Another, another two high-grade technical manuals, that might actually be really nice. Because for the first time, we are just now starting to even begin to run out of technology points. The fact that we're under 20, even with these two books. We're at 19 tech points. Okay. Alright, let's go back. Got some ore, got some pallium fragments. Should have enough for the basics now. Are you working and it's just not showing that? I think I think that's what's happening here. Uh, things are T-posing. 
There it goes. Now the animations are in. That was weird. That was really strange. There we go. Okay. So, Paladin Fragments. Um, cement. That's right. How do you even make cement? What are the ingredients we're looking for? You get 10 cement by doing 1 pal fluid, 1 bone, and 50 stone. Oh, easy. Ooh, time consuming. Go ahead and work on that. Um, we don't have the ingots for the handgun. Okay. Repair should be soon, but not quite yet. The grand piano's done. Looks nice. I wish we could play at it. That would be great. High quality cloth is not happening anytime soon. Yeah, we can use those materials. Alright, here's our nice bed. I'm going to put it in the center of the room, obviously, because it's the bed. Even though I do like beds up against the wall. I don't want it in the window in case it rains, and I don't want it right here because it's right up the stairs. Maybe I do. Maybe I can do like a barrier here, maybe? Could do it up against this corner. Yeah, do it up against this corner, and then we can maybe build like a, a partition here or something. Could do something like that. Just waiting on those ingots to get done. High quality hot spring would look nice in the stables for sure. This is where I can fit the antique cabinet. I can fit it up here. Because I don't have that downstairs anymore. Yeah, I can put it in the room. Perfect. You can even put it like right there, like that. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Uh, antique wall cabinet with the bed on it, with the plant on it and everything. We need three red berries. Don't have that. Alright. Oh, we have the long cabinet downstairs. I don't want two of the same thing. Those always, that always looks weird. Um. <laughs> that's a lot there I need to make, isn't there? Uh, breeding farm eventually is gonna happen, so let's start figuring out where we're gonna put this, I guess, while thing while people are working on things pals are working on things the ranch is over here we could do it over here maybe I still want it next to the stables this thing is massive look at the size of this breeding farm oh my god why is it so big oh or just respond we don't want it to interrupt the ore obviously as little ore interruption as possible is good. Does that work? Would that interrupt the ore? I'm not sure. Um, that might interrupt an ore spawn. Here, hold up. I'm not sure about that one. I know there's no ore over here, but this isn't going to fit here. It's way too big, right? I mean, it could if I got rid of the cooking pot, maybe. Moved it somewhere else. I don't know. That's iffy to me. Are you gonna mine that? Oh, I think they are. Yes, they are! Let's go! They're doing it! They're mining the ore for us. Finally, we have infinite ore. It's not gonna be fast yet. They're clearly not quick at it. But infinite ore is still infinite ore, even if it's slow. We take that every time. Oh yes, I'm pumped about that. Are we out of fibers? Oh, 55. I thought that said 5. I was about to say. Um, alright. We should have more ingots now. Let me grab those. Enough for the power generator at least. Here we go. Nice. If I put this between the assembly lines, it'll look pretty good, I think. And then we have an assembly line up, 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 against, up against this wall, maybe. No, I think I want to build this out further this way. And maybe move the logging stand one day. Yes, they're mining the ore. So we'll just have a power generator here. Tucked away in the back. And I think that'll be fine. 20 electric organs, 50 ingots. That's a lot of workload. Get the Pang Kings on it. Katiba, you doing anything out here? You doing a damn thing, Katiba? 
I don't think the Lucky Cativas are good enough for anything we want to do here. Do I have any more Penkings? They're such great workers. I don't think I do. Cinemoth. Grimtail. Sweez. No, I don't think so. I got Tombat who can mine and transport things. That could be worth more than whatever these guys can do, yeah. Hate to say that, but it might be true. As much as I love showing off the shinies, I don't think they're going to be worth as much. And we don't have a good Mozzarina. Zen Mind means less sanity drain, I guess? No, increase the neutral attack damage. Okay, Muscle Head is very bad for working. Damn it. That's a fighting Pan King, not a working Pan King. What does Relaxosaurus do? Two watering and one transport? Mech. Mech, I say mech. Grab a Tansy again, I guess. Better than what the Cativas were doing. It's a really good Tansy, too. That guy's set to go. Okay. Look how big the Alpha Pen King is. He's up there. Looking big. Alright, I hope you guys finish this up. And then we'll have that built. And then we can level up the base for the first time in I don't even know how long. I have no idea how long it's been since we've upgraded the base. But it's been a long damn time. Base upgrade. Weapon assembly line and high quality hot spring. I was already going to make the high quality hot spring. Weapon assembly line makes sense, I guess. We can make three bases on the next level. Wow. So 10 for the first one, first extra base, and then 15 for the next? It's very reasonable. How's the cement coming along? We getting it? He's working on it. The water brown cherry saddle would be nice. It takes 18 and gets what? Oh, sorry. You keep going, man. Keep working on that. We need more ingots. I need a better transporter, clearly, because they're not doing it. Does Lavander transport level 2? Yes, she does. And Handiwork level 2. That's a pretty good one. Put her in. Put her in, coach. 24 more. I don't think we have a lot of ingots right now. 36. Not even enough for a handgun, shockingly. Shockingly, nice power generating right there. We love that. 7%, it's getting up there. Power online to make spheres. Okay, we need cement for the big spheres? Oh my god. Re five refined ingots for an ultra sphere. That's disgusting. Carbon fiber? <laughs> what? It's an epic sphere. Is that the ultimate sphere? Let me look through tech tree real quick. See if there's any more spheres. There's a legendary sphere and then that's it. Wow. That's the second best sphere in the game. No wonder it's so expensive. Yeah, you guys are doing great. Mind that ore, mind that ore. Okay, what else do we not need here? We don't need any more gold coins, Mal. I appreciate everything you've done for us. And you were serious, you were a great worker, but... It's time to put someone else in that can do more for us. Level 2 handiwork, level 2 transport. That'll work for now. She's not... Is, the, is she a better worker for that? No, just minus attack. Damn. I was hoping maybe that would work out, but no. Brutal's no good, obviously. That's a great rush ore, but... It's just not our top 5 pals. Some of these pals are really good, they're just not... Top 5, so we can't actually use them. Disappointingly. Level 2 Kindling and a Lumber is better than what Fox Parks brings to the table. So even though this is an Artisan... Man, I just don't know if that's better or not. I really don't. I really don't know. Incineram is so versatile. We have two Tansies out here. We could try this. Maybe that'll work out for the better. But we've... We're kind of trying everything here. And I think we've done what we can. 
Okay, we need to put that with the other alphas. Running out of space in that box, I'm telling you. And we got a lot of pals we probably need to sell in the near future. I don't know. Three ingots. That ain't enough. Catrus looks pretty cool, actually. I was sleeping on Catrus a little bit. Not gonna lie. Sleeping on Catrus a little bit. I don't have an... I'm not, Incineram is our nocturnal miner. What am I talking about? Yes, we do. There he is. Nice. So once we get enough of those done, we will be able to make the handgun. Uh, we need like 10... He, we need him to cook up 10 more. What else can we be building in the meantime? High quality hot spring. That's right. The cement. Is the cement done? It is done. Nice. Let's go ahead and make more... Oh, wait. Yeah. Do we have... We do have the average already. Large feed bag would be good. Go ahead and pop that out. Catris, if you could work on that, that'd be excellent. Thank you. I'm super appreciative of that. Okay, so the high quality hot spring is way bigger. Oh my goodness. I'm just going to put it out here at this point. Put it right next to the stables instead. Chop this lumber down, get it out of the way. And then we'll have space for that. There's just not enough space in there for a legendary... Not legendary, for a high quality hot spring. We'll leave that in there so that there's two hot springs. There's nothing else I want to use that space for. Look at that, over 3,000 stone and wood is so good. Yeah, it's in the stonework. Actually works really well. Because it's stones all around it. And the steps right here? Oh man, that looks really nice actually. That's going to take way too long. Okay, high quality spot hot spring is on the way. What was it? A weapon assembly line that we need? Yeah, weapon assembly line. Let me bring more stone foundations down so that we can keep expanding this region of the base. We're never going to run out of stone. I, I know that. Alright, and that should be enough space for another assembly line without getting too cramped. Because I'm sure we could cram them together, but I don't I don't really want to do that. Production assembly line would take 100 ingots. Yikes. And 100 ingots there. Oh, God. And 10 high-quality power oil. Whoa! Whoa, I say whoa. Almost got the ingots for the handgun. Alright, let's take a look at these stats on the guns. I'm ready. I'm so pumped and ready for this. Uh... Hold up. The musket has a thousand attack! Yes! An old-fashioned simple gun fires a single powerful shot at the expense of a long reload time. And the makeshift handgun has 320. A handgun created from spare parts. Relatively well suited for close quarters combat, but can only fire one shot before needing to reload. I wonder how fast the reload is to make that worth it. I want to try both of them, obviously. The makeshift handgun is barely stronger than the crossbow. But I'm assuming that it can shoot, like it can reload and shoot faster than the crossbow. I'm not sure. The musket having a thousand attack, but a really long reload time sounds fun as well. But we have the high quality pal oil. We're just waiting on the ingots to be able to make this handgun. And now we have it. There it is. That's what we needed. Handgun time. Nice. A real handgun. We're skipping steps here. I want to use everything at least a couple times. Well, these are the only weapons that can use the coarse ammo, so I need to figure out which one of these I like more. And then we'll use that with our coarse ammo, and then obviously the handgun will use the handgun ammo. Instead of the grappling gun, where, why ever that's there. And then, um, the single shot rifle takes refined ingots. That's not happening anytime soon. It's just not. The improved furnace probably isn't happening anytime soon. Actually, we can make that really easy. Wow. Those ingredients are not tough. Alright, it's time we help with the building a bit. Not the quickest miners in the world, do we? They definitely take their time. Ooh, large feed bag is ready. Nice. Okay, uh, and they're ready for the next feed bag? I thought I had the next feed bag. Hold up. No, the large is the one I made. Okay. Just kidding. We don't have the huge feedback yet. 
Or do I? I think I, I think I do. But it takes carbon fiber anyway, so that's not happening anytime soon. Handguns taking work. Alright, they're working. Yeah, high quality hot spring is done. Very nice. Which means all we have left is the weapon assembly line, but that's going to take so many ingots. Get to mining, everybody. Oh, heck yeah. Do you have any more tombats? I can mine, like, at night. We just don't need logging that much anymore. I, I would replace them with more miners, for sure. There we go. Uh, Over the tansy, yeah. He's a workaholic, but he's not doing anything that we absolutely need. He's mostly a logger, can transport some things, but so can this tombat. Yeah, and he's a miner. That can actually break down ore. They broke an ore. They're working. They're doing the thing. All right, how's the electricity going? Sonic. 24%, all right. You're doing great. You're doing excellent. Um, any other workers? That would be great here. Um, they're also level 1 at electricity. I don't think we have a level 2 electricity generator. I don't think so. Wait, Dumbuds are level 2 miners? Really? Once you, yeah, 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 okay. Um, Dumbud. Oh boy, really? What do we name the male chicken? This one's Kentucky. Alright, I know we had a Kentucky in the past, but this is the real Kentucky. No, this is the Colonel! <laughs> yes! It's the Colonel. Not just Colonel, the Colonel. There you go. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> Alright, Fila, I need to put you away. We make plenty of food with just one of you, and I can put Dumbud in here to do more mining. Get in there, Dumbud. That thing is a mess. Did you see that thing out there? He's flopping around. Okay. Don't need that. No, no. Okay. I think that's good. I think I'm finally happy with the workers we have. Level 3 transport would be nice. And he's a runner, so he's super fast at transporting. Um... If I level it up again, I might I might throw him in here. Let me grab him in case we throw him in there later, but I think for now we're good. Just level one lumberers? Those guys are useless. Level two handiwork? Not by much. What do woolly pops do? It sometimes drops cotton candy when assigned to ranch. That's fun. Uh, let me put him here. Because I'll probably put him in next. Thank you. 44 more ingots, please. Get to work on that. Is the handgun done? The handgun's done! Nice! Let's build more cement. Let's build 10 cement. We're clearly going to need more cement in this game. 500 stone for 100 cement. Yikes. That's a lot of stone, chief. But okay. Lavander, get on it. Okay. And then we need gunpowder to be able to make those things. Which is fair enough. Okay, how's the handgun looking? 250. Pistol with improved capacity and rapid fire capabilities. Has more immediate firepower than a makeshift handgun. Right. So it's actually slightly weaker than a crossbow, which is shocking. But obviously you can fire it multiple times before needing to reload. You can go pop, 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 etc. Hmm. I'm a little disappointed in the attack power there. This musket looks great. Love that. Um, coarse ammo. Only three pounds for all that coarse ammo. Hell yeah. Okay, we gotta we gotta try all these. Uh, we only have sixteen hand ammo, handgun ammo, so we're not gonna be able to use that much. But okay, there we have it. Cement's a big work in progress. Um, the improved furnace. Once we have some cement, yeah, we can actually make that. That's not bad at all. I love how much progression we can we can do now. I love it. And they're getting... Whoops. And they're getting through the ingots pretty well. The ore pretty well. I think this one's still my responsibility because it's out of range. And while I'm deciding what to do, I don't mind chopping this down while they're working on that. Plenty of miners to make sure the ore mine is going well. 
If they finish all the ore before it respawns, that's how we know we have plenty of miners. I can't believe this whole time level 2 mining can get, can mine ore. I'm so dumb. Just like Dumbud. Dumbud, you are a goofy looking creature. But I love you. <clears throat> Catra's working on the cement now. There's our only lumberer, but really, we only need the one, if we're being honest. I just realized that when I'm making the defenses for this place, I'll just make it outside the blue line. Because pals, the blue line is for the pals. I can build outside the blue line. Like, here, let me, let me see. I'd be shocked if they don't let me build outside the blue line. Uh, defensive wall. One cement and ten stone. Jesus. Oh, I'm not in the blue line, so I can't access it. That's funny. <laughs> Alright, well. Uh, here, the wooden wall, then. Yeah, because I can build this outside the wall, right? I gotta be in the wall to get the materials, but... Yeah, I could build it, like, right here. And work around from there. Just with stone instead of wood, please. Oh yeah, there's there's potential here for sure. This ache deer deer is doing a great job. We love you. Is it fully powered? Sonic? 48%? Okay. It's not bad. It's not great, but it's not bad. Our socks in the hot spring is a little interesting. Looks happy to be there though. Alright, that's the rest of the fried eggs. Um, there's 50 more already. Make some mozzarella steak. There's ten, there's ten cement. It's a start. 22 ingots. That's a start as well. So much work ahead of us. So much work ahead of us. We're super set on food, so I can put these fried eggs away for them. You guys go ahead and eat up. Maybe I should put the feed box right outside the stables. Because, um, like we said, the egg deer deer can't actually fit in there. I love how they can both mine it and bring it back. Yes, sir. And the eggs go in the feed box. Oh, yes. Yes! I'm going to leave this furnace along with the improved furnace once we build it. Because we'll be able to cook more than one thing at more than one stack of ingots at the same time. Which means we can actually use these multiple cookers we have. The sandbag is a really cool idea, but I want the mounted machine guns. <laughs> Be awesome. Pickaxe with helmet takes 50 ingots, though. That's when, we'll, when we have extra st stuff, we'll do that. Take wooden chair. Those might be the chairs we put with the dinner table, maybe? Oh, no, the antique green wooden chair, probably. We have all the venom glands in the world. Can I put this under the table, or is it too late? Oh, shoot, I gotta move the table, don't I? Yep. That sucks. Oh well. There we go. Good. Should have given me the stuff back for the table. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. There we go. And then get the chairs in. Uh, I should have keep. I should have right clicked instead of left clicking. It's a six-person table. That's plenty of food. That's plenty of space, right? Absolutely, that's plenty of space. This might not be perfectly straight. I might have to fix it in the future, but I think this is a good start. There we go. Nice. Whoa. What just happened? What just happened? The bed broke? Why? Why did that break? Hello? What is going on? We're not at a, like a build cap, are we? No way they have something like that without telling me. Put a little gap there, I guess, to make sure that they don't break each other. I don't know. We'll figure that out later, but I'm a little stressed out about this. 
I don't know what's going on, but that's some fishy stuff going on. Oh, yeah, let's do that. Oh, it's ingots. Never mind. Don't do that. JK. These also take ingots, so no. That's a great idea for an outside container. The cloth covering. I like that a lot. Um, Anything else we need? We have the fireplaces. A lamp. Wood nails and electric organs. Chandelier we're going to want eventually, but we can just do this for now. That is not implemented correctly. This is. So let's go with that. Okay. You guys are doing great on the cement. I appreciate that. 30 cement. That's what we needed for something. What did we need 30 cement for? Ah, uh, shoot. What was I working on? Oh, I need to make wooden bar stools. Yeah, absolutely. Hold up. Let me use this, some of this wood that's in my inventory. Of course you need bar stools for the bar. How could you not? Okay, why are things breaking? I'm stressing out about this. What is happening here? Why are things breaking in my base? I don't understand why this is happening. Now the table here is gone. And I'm also underneath the floor. No, I did not just stuck myself for real. There's no, no way. Thank you. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I was going to have to break my house to get out. I am so confused by all this. Let me just build these so they're more permanent, maybe? Are there too many planned buildings? Like, I, I don't know. I, I have no idea what's going on here. It's super strange to me. The, the rug is gone. Son of a... Damn it. I gotta break this. I gotta break this. But I can't have that there because I don't have the rug yet. Why is this being so difficult? Is there something wrong with that specific carpet? Put this under the under the table maybe? I think that's a tansy in the distance. That is so weird how everything is breaking around me. I don't like it. I really, really don't like it. Just let me build and not break things by existing, please. Something broke again. What broke this time? More tables, up, more chairs over there. Maybe there is a build limit. Maybe after you have too many things set up, it, it gets mad. Because there's too many plans in place. I just don't know, so we're just gonna get to building, I guess. While our pals are working on ingots and stuff, and we got nothing better to do, let's go ahead and knock everything into place. As we continue to build everything this house is going to need. Nice to have a, a light in here with that lamp. Okay. And of course, the pals don't like going in the home, I've noticed, so... Upset and went to bed. Okay, nighty night. How much time we have left in the day, by the way? It's not really telling me. I can't sprint because of the overweight, so I can't... That's how I usually get the day HUD to show up. Damn. Hopefully we still have some time, but I know we've spent a lot of time by this point. Building our home and getting everything ready to go. So I wouldn't be surprised if we're running out of time here. It's been very successful. Is the ore back? Are they are they mining ore again? Man, I would love that. Good. I, I was I was starting to wonder if I'd be able to reach this <laughs> this rug. 
It'll still be good to have this rug underneath the table, because that'll give you a foot, your feet somewhere soft to rest. Uh, at least if you're on the front and back, because apparently these side seats don't do that. Jesus. That cement's taking all day. Oh yeah, the ingot farm! We are moving now! Hell yeah, let's go! Let's go! That's going so well! Absolutely, I'm super happy with that. Let's keep working in here. I remember we couldn't have a carpet over there because this overhang we made is like messing with the build. I'm not sure why, but it's in early access. Maybe one day it'll get fixed, but this is also not our going to be our final base probably, but it is going to be our base for a very, very long time. Um, wow, we can put cement in here. True. I don't use this barrel very often, but it's there. I need to remember that. Two and a half minutes! Have mercy! I'll move over here for a, si for a sec. And then go check on the egg, because that's, cr that's crazy talk. Oh, I can sprint again. Okay, we still got about a third of the day left before it's the night. And then that'll be 36 days. And our level will be the same amount as of days that have passed. It's been a it's been good progress. I know we didn't get out much. I know we didn't accomplish a ton. Like, definitely not in the world. But we leveled up the base. The base is coming together. It's starting to look good. Our first base, man. I want it to be absolutely stellar. There we go. Two and a half minutes. That's crazy. That cement is taking them all day, too. That's done cooking. The the damp egg is ready to incubate. What do we have here? Another pen king. It's a glutton, so it would eat a lot, but still. That's awesome. Because <laughs> pen kings are great workers. They are excellent workers. Ironically enough, since they're supposed to be like kings. And yet, they're absolutely stellar workers. The improved furnace, that's what I was waiting on the cement for. Why didn't I build that sooner? God, my memory's terrible. An improved furnace. This could also go up here. Yes, absolutely. Right next to where the fireplace is, too. The fireplace is on the other side of this. Uh, here's the opening. Where they'll blow in, I'm guessing. Okay. You guys can pound that out for sure, literally. Uh, ingots. Wood, I, I guess I'll keep that on me. Venom glands, cloth, okay. How are we doing on food? Everybody's good? Everybody's happy? Uh, that gives one sanity and 80 nutrition. Thick, well done steak. I gotta eat one just because it's steak. Oh my god, so good. Alright. Let's put the others in the feed box for sanity reasons. Not a lot of food in there, actually. Most of the food's out in that. Alright, they're gonna finish that up and I can start making more ingots for sure. Improve furnace down. Ta-da. Refined ingots take ore and coal. Oh, we can make refined ingots. That's not even hard. I'm a little shocked by that. That's not even that difficult. They're just waiting for the ore to spawn again. I dig that. Yeah, that's kind of crazy, to be honest. Okay, they move at about the same pace. Weapon assembly line is going to take 100. We're at 54. It's also going to take 10 high quality pal oil. We might need to go out and catch more. Um, might need to go out and catch more Relaxosauruses. Let me get rid of the crossbow because we have guns to use now. I know it's about to break. If we ever use the crossbow again, I might make this to see how good it could be. For now, let's tr let's put the musket in there. And we'll put the crossbow away into the weapons bench. How much... Okay. 
I want to see how they compare, but it's 30 ingots and ancient civ parts. I don't want to burn all that quite yet, so... Stun baton with more electric organs, and electrocuted pals are easy to capture. That would be really nice to have. Won't lie. Cement's coming along. Uh, sphere assembly should be happening. We have a lot of spheres we need made. Um, gigaspheres, we have how many? Let me make sure we have an easy, even dozen. So let's make two gigaspheres. They look good. Going down the assembly line like that. It doesn't 100% make sense, but it looks good. I'll help him build this real quick. Then I want to make sure I have 24 megaspheres, because those are starting to become the more norm. We have night. Okay. 21 should make those. You work on that while I work on my bed that apparently needs building. It's going to take a lot of work knocking this out. Fried eggs are done getting produced. That's good. Um, Incineram is crafting. When Incineram is done crafting, that's how I'll know the megaspheres have been made, I suppose. If they're not done by the time I'm done building this bed. Honestly, that could be my storage area right there. Just a ton of chests just lining the walls. Um, with all of our stuff. It would make sense. We have so many pankings, dude. <laughs> They're just so good work. They're just such good workers, man. They're so good. Why would you build a plantation for food? Unless there's like some recipes out there that I should be making for sanity reasons or something. One lucky chickpea is all we need to make enough food for all these workers. Crazy enough. Is he done crafting that? Well, we made good progress on the bed. It's coming along. He did not... He did. Wow, that was fast. And then how many pal spheres can we... Oh my goodness. Um... Like I said, these are starting to go out of style. The mega spheres are way, way better. Um... Let's make 49 so we have the even 50. And then we can keep going to other things for now. The ingots are coming along. We love that. War has not respawned yet. They're just out here transporting. I love it. Almost everyone is always doing something at some point. The power is looking really nice. Good job, guys. Yeah, you can craft those fast. Oh my god, the pal spheres go quick. You hear that? Am I just hearing things? Why am I hearing a lucky? Why am I hearing a lucky? You hear it, right? But the noise isn't getting any quieter or louder. You hear that, right? Why am I hearing lucky sounds? But definitely not seeing any. By the way, do you have a level 3 miner? I'm still on the lookout, even if, you know, can't talk while riding. Interesting. I'm, I guess I'm crazy? I mean, it's not unfeasible. It's definitely possible that I'm just crazy, but... I was so sure I heard a shine, a lucky. But now I'm not so sure. Wow, okay. I guess I'm crazy. I still kind of hear it. What is that sound? But like I said, it's not getting any louder or quieter. That's weird. Does that just keep ringing until, like, is there a Lucky somewhere on the map, but nowhere near us?
Yeah, I don't know. I'm just heading back. Sorry about that. I just totally wasted time thinking I heard something that I guess I didn't. Maybe I need to check my ears. Because I still kind of hear it, but at the same time, like, why? It wouldn't make any sense. Let me know, let me know if you heard it or, you know, maybe I am crazy. Cow sphere score. What is making that sound? I don't know. Anyway, moving on. Back to what we were doing. So now we have 12 gigaspheres, 24 megaspheres, and 51 pal spheres. We make more megaspheres. That's so many ingots. Also, we are only three ingots away. Let's go. Weapon assembly line. High quality power oil. That's right. Let me go and cement. Good. Um, we have the large feed bag. We have the hip lantern. We have all that good stuff. We don't need more nails at the moment. We will need gunpowder one day. I don't know when, but let's make 20 for now. You guys can work on that. So we can start making our ammo. Okay, leather and wood. <clears throat> Alright, it's time to go catch some Relaxosauruses again. For the high quality pal oil. Um, or should we do that tomorrow? We're running out of time. Let's finish the bed. While everybody's working on stuff. Looks like gunpowder gets made somewhat quickly. That's nice. Oh, the bed is done. Nice. Thanks, guys. They could get in there. This is running out of time. <laughs> okay, interesting. One more ingot. That's right. Alright. We've built a ton of... We've fleshed out the home quite a bit. It's definitely still not done, but we've made a lot of progress in making this place look livable. A lot of progress. Um, I started working on the bedroom. Uh, there's no, like, dividers, is there? I don't think so. Maybe with the restroom stuff? There was, like, restroom stuff in here. Here we go, an antique partition. Exactly that. That's what I'm talking about. That's exactly the kind of thing I was looking for. Okay. Just like that. That's exactly what I was talking about. Okay. Yeah, that'll work. So that's our partition. And then... We could also, you know... <laughs> antique bathtub? No, this area does not work. I gotta get rid of this overhang, man. It just doesn't work. I thought it was gonna be a cool idea, but it's just... It's not working out. It's not working out. Damn. Alright. We do need a restroom at some point, though, for sure. Antique couch. Could line that up right there once we get rid of these chests and move that stuff somewhere else. Uh, I'm also going to want a, a rug in my room, aren't I? What's one we haven't used yet? Uh, the antique red. We have not used yet, actually, because of the previous events. Move it right here in the corner. Whoops, that's not the right button. <laughs> Alright, I think we're going to go exploring again tomorrow. I think we made plenty of progress here today. We have our guns made. We have an ore cycle running. So they're going to keep working on the ore problem while we're gone. Um, it's, not, um, it's not a huge problem anymore, but it is still a problem. We don't have enough. Barely have enough to make this weapon assembly line we're about to make. Table reel, garbage bags, earthen... Why would we want any of these? Ironwood low table. No. Ironwood table. Uh, 
yeah, we need high quality power oil, and then we can make the weapon assembly line, and then we can level up again. Uh, okay, do we have the inventory space? Eh, not really, to be honest. Alright, I want to destroy these boxes. Okay, so I can destroy these two. That and that. And then put the storage here. I don't want to just keep making wooden chests though. What what what's gonna look good? These small containers take ingots, unfortunately. Um, do they store items actually? What? These these areas can actually store items? I had no idea. Wait, I'm an idiot. I was just doing it because they look good. Oh my god, hold up. This is great news. That means we have more storage spaces. Actually, this is a lot of storage spaces in this one. This long cabinet right here has all the all the room we need for these fruits, just about. Alright, this is our this is our <laughs> Whoops, wrong way. I did this backwards. Yeah, there we go. This this antique log cabinet had enough space for all of our fruits. And then this bookshelf too? Really? Really? Okay, they actually serve a purpose. I didn't actually think they would. I'm going to be straight with you. That is a little shocking. The wooden barrel shelves too? Wow. We actually have so much storage. Why did I make these? A little over uncovered, but that's okay. Go ahead and make these partitions. And then that'll have to be an episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. And if you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. But either way, thank you so much for joining me on this journey in Pal World. It has been 36 days. We are level 36. And we just now have guns to be able to bring... Well, it's about to be day 37. And we just now have guns to be able to test out and bring out into the real world. It took a long time, and it was a long time coming, but we are finally there, and I can't wait to explore their potential and see some new things with you guys next time. Thank you again. And I'll see all of you for day 37 and 38 out in the Bamboo Grove next time. Beautiful.